Dan here from wikigameguides.com bringing you the Fire Sanctuary Temple for Zelda Skyward Sword on the Nintendo Wii. So this temple, hmm, I didn't find it as hard as the last two as far as puzzles go. Or at least not as many. Uh, not as many places where I got stuck. And when I did get stuck, one of the reasons was because... Because I don't like to try all the... Well, I'll explain it later when I get to it. But I had to do with those water plants. So, uh... Get some archery done while you're floating down this lava lake. And when you kill the archers, usually they drop arrows, so be sure to stay well stocked on your arrows. And then once you kill all those guys, that opens up and gets you your first small key to get in this door below you. Bob Coblin. Bocoblin. Hey, buddy. I said earlier that I really like the robots, like um, Skipper from uh, Sand Sea, but I do like the Mogmas too. They're pretty funny and they're nice. They just love their treasure. On to the next room. Golden Skull, all right. I don't know why I'm getting so many of those. None of the other good treasures. Quick little treasure here. 20 bucks. Thank <laughs> you. 
All right, so we got these weird, this weird fire hand dude. So when you jump down, you want him to come up right under the rock. For some reason, he came up next to the rock and smacked me in the face right there. But if you get him to come up under this rock, it's a nice little elevator for you. So, before you try crossing uh, on that vine, you want to take out these archers so that they don't shoot you while you're climbing and you fall back down. You can see there's a dig hole right there. It's actually a magma mitt hole that if you want to, you can come back there later once you have the magma mitts and get to an empty bottle treasure chest. But I'll, uh, I'll point that out and make a separate video for it when I get to that spot. So this is kind of like a super Lizafo, he's like poisonous instead of shooting fire. So you want to make sure to block his tail attacks so that you can get some shots on him. And sometimes you can get skyward strikes to hit when he's like about to spit poison at you or something. Yeah, like right before he does that. You can see how tough he is. Now when you block his thing and you don't like, counter attack, you just want to make sure that your shield's not too low. You don't want to lose your nice shield. So, take his tail and head on through to the next area.